That's right. Self-driving cars always seem to be like some sort of technology you'd only see in sci-fi movies. But guess what? It is here, believe it or not. And we're in the Ford section right now. Behind me is their version of their autonomous vehicle. And you know, when you get here to the auto show, there's so many opportunities to learn more. There's actually an exhibit that offers test drives, and it also gives you the engineering and science that goes behind it. So you walk away with a better understanding. Move over electric cars. Autonomous vehicles are the big talker at this year's North American International Auto Show. The Automobility exhibit answers all the questions surrounding driverless cars. Besides seeing them in action, you can see the technology that goes into it. Like, how can it detect other drivers, pedestrians, or moving objects on the road? Well, Michigan State University has a team on hand with equipment that has radar to determine what's around the car. The model will predict that these people are like pedestrians sitting, moving, and even we can predict their uh, direction of movement. So in order to navigate through them and avoid their uh, like hitting them, basically. What about technology inside an autonomous vehicle? If you don't need to steer the steering wheel, will it still move? You have a cup of coffee in the hand and you happen to touch the steering wheel, you can have coffee all over you. That's not a good thing. Patrick Ryan explains how using wireless technology, the steering wheel doesn't need to move while the car makes twists and turns. Right now, it is in prototypes that are being driven on test tracks around the world. The company is hoping to be in production by 2021. You click the button and it will stay stationary. And the road wheels continue turning and driving the vehicle through while your hand wheel is standing still. And back here in Ford, again, you could check out their autonomous vehicle, and they have some features that you could check out, too. Maybe you could te test your parking skills, and over here, you could take a selfie. And it's not just any normal selfie. It is a self-driving selfie. So it will show you what the car sees when you get in front of it. So that over there is my selfie. Hold on. The picture's going to be taken in two, one. Here we go. There we go. Now it's saved. So it's fun stuff to do for everybody to come out here. And guess what? You know, there's even so much more fun things to do, family fun things. You don't just come out here and just look at the cars. There's so many things that you could be interactive with. We're talking about virtual rides, a simulator, and we're going to have all of that coming up at 4.30. But for now, I'll send it back to you, Stephen.